as easy as playing a game, and you don't even have to say a word. That's right. With us now are the authors of My Smart Puppy, Sarah Wilson, and celebrity dog trainer Brian Kilcommons, and their dog Pip, who is uh, quite a delight. Oh, and he already her, <laughs> knew I was talking about uh, <laughs> him or her. Let's get a shot of Pip. There we see Pip. Okay, so first of all, what are the things, Brian, that we do as dog owners when we first get a puppy that are mistakes that we should not do? Lack of teaching, yelling no, any type of scruff shaking or alpha rolling, where you're taking the dog, turning it, and pinning it. All you're going to do is get bitten or hurt. So and it's saying not the no approach. doesn't work? No. Yeah. Dogs don't understand no. What we've done with My Smart Puppy is a series of games. We're teaching the puppies what we want instead of saying what we don't want. So it's so much easier for them to learn. Plus, it's a, it's a lot of fun playing games with your puppy. What's a good way to read your dog? I mean, they're telling us a lot that we don't know. Great question. Because dogs communicate through physical signals. We're the ones who do verbal. So if you don't know how to read the dog, it's really hard to understand what they're saying. So you're saying that you really have to pay attention and you call it teeth, which is the tension, ears, eyes, tail, and head. We're going to look at some pictures and you can explain what we're seeing. So let's uh, first put up a dog. There we go. What is this dog trying to tell us? Well, look at the tension in the body. Would you say this puppy is comfortable? Doesn't if you just look at it. Yeah, he's, he's frightened. He's getting yeah. a bath or something, right? Right. He's, he's stressed. Head down, tail down. Okay. So the tension in the overall body, all right, as far as if you look at the eyes and the ears, there's still a lot of tension in that. Okay? And then the face is kind of wrinkled. Okay, let's take a look at another one. Any moment now. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like he's beat. He's, put, he, he's pooped. Right. He's like, whatever. <laughs> he might be enjoying a massage. You never know. Right. I'm done. So that, he's basically relaxed. And you can see a certain softness. I feel in like that's, is that the dog that won the dog show, the last dog show that took place? I think that's that humongous. It looks like an English so What, what mood stuff. do you want your dog in when uh, you want to train the animal? Okay, you want two things. You want response, but you also want relaxation. For the dog to be stressed. I got you. All, All right. right, you're saying when you, it's not a good time to try to get them to listen when they're clearly stressed. Uh, let's take a look at another dog. Well, it's also like you know, trying to teach when you take a test. Oh. Uh. Or what is this dog telling us? The He's dog, hungry. The dog on the right is submissive. And, Tail and, down. and the dog on the left, the shepherd, that yawning is stress. Really? Yes. So learning how they're to read They're not your... tired, they're yawning because they're stressed. Yes. All right, one more picture. What do you do when your mother just begs constantly? Well, the first thing we're going to do is we teach her how to look away from food. We don't teach dogs how to do that, and we assume that they know, and they don't. So the first game we're going to play is I hold this out, and she gets a treat if she looks away. So hold it out. So I'm teaching her that if I put food down, she's not supposed she to look to at me. She knows to ignore it. She knows wow. to look at me. So instead of telling her no, which doesn't teach her, I give her a yes, look at me instead. And is that what drives almost all animal behavior? Something to do with food? Even not at all. It can be play. It can be affection. It depends dog to dog. Mm -hmm. But she's a young dog, so we're With the My food. Smart Puppy book and DVD, we have 23 different puppies we've worked Good with care. in there. And it really shows people how to get quick behavior where the dog is happy and you're getting the responses that you want. Plus, the games make training fun. And we have to move out of this whole relationship of conflict. All right, and show us the leash demonstration about how uh, they're, they're supposed to know that you know, you're know you in charge and you're in command when you're walking. It, oh, it's not even in charge. What we teach her is that she should follow and watch me and follow my movement. I come forward, she backs up, I stop, she stops, she does what I do. And there's no conflict. Um, we have a little game called Catch My Drift. We teach them that when they feel any pressure on the lead, they're to look up. So we teach that when they're calm, so that when you need it in life, they already know it. Life is not a time to teach. This is the time to teach when she's nice and calm. Sit. Good girl. Catch my drift. That, that dog can read minds, by the way. Yeah, really? Yeah. Wow. really? He's got a PhD in obedience. She's uh, great. It's she didn't my, start that way. My Smart Puppy is the name of the book, and also it comes with a DVD that's an hour long for all members of the family. Right. We sold separately. Yeah. yeah, so the whole family can watch it to get that consistency, and we'll be doing book signings with Barnes & Noble all over the country cool. and showing people how to get better behavior with their dogs and, and they can puppies. bring their dogs with them at the book signings. All right, Brian, sure. Kilcommons, and Sarah Wilson, thanks so much. Thank, thank you. And Pip, thank you. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, buddy. Okay. All right, coming up, the latest uh, port security plan isn't going to do anything to really make us safer. We're going to talk to a congressman who is directly involved. Plus, a college football game gone wild. Kind of looks like a hockey game there. Stay tuned for the big-time brawl. And if you thought...
All right, it is two minutes before the hour. Greg, come join us. Wow, well, we can do that. There's no place for me to sit. Oh. <laughs> right here. Oh, Greg, you know what? Come, come on, on over, big guy. Greg, come on over. Sorry, with <laughs> unceremoniously. Good, goodbye. Time nice, on. nice, nice Take to see care. you. Take care. It's that, all right. That's not how we're supposed this to. This is what happens. This is what happens behind I didn't the show. Realize you didn't behind the scenes, show. Not, not on the scenes. Exactly. <laughs> oh well, we've just given you a little glimpse into what. Now, why don't you get a shot under the desk here. for good measure? There she, she goes off, you know, there. just unceremoniously. I, um, I, I apologize. All right.